You know, one thing we just naturally do at Imagineering is everything we do is based on story. We build our entire work process around story. And that's not just kind of a clever thing that you say. Human beings, all human beings, are wired for story. It is one of the things that makes us human. It's what our brains do. So when you organize around story, both organizationally and in terms of the product that you're producing, it's this incredible lubricant towards getting things done because the human brain itself is already a story machine. So it's a very easy way to put together information to get humans to understand it, both getting it done and when it's done, what it is. So it's a very Disney thing to do, but it actually has this very universal, broad application in terms of how to organize, how to communicate, how to evaluate. Uh, if you know the story you're trying to tell, it makes it really easy to know whether is it choice A or choice B? Is this good or bad? Does it match or not match what we're trying to say? A lot of times people jump past, why am I making a statement? Why am I taking action? And they jump right to the action, right? And now they're stuck evaluating what they're doing on the basis of its present value alone. Well, is this one cheaper? Is this one more expensive? Is that one easier? Is this one more difficult? But no one ever took the time to say, why did we start? What are we trying to say? What is the story of our effort to get this done? Why are we here? That's what we do. And that makes it much easier for us later when someone has to decide, you want that lighting fixture or that one? You know, oh, well, I want that one because that one says why we're here, right? You have to cut something. You can't afford three of these things. Which one do you cut? Well, I cut that one because that one the least says why we're here. It's really easy as you go down the line to do it. And I think that is something we could teach the world of organization uh, that is a very Disney way of behaving.